So, we're getting closer and closer to the resumption of golf, which is great. I bet you're all looking forward to getting back to it, I certainly am. Now, one of the things that tends to drop off uh, in terms of performance when we've had quite a long time out of golf, which obviously I think we've probably had the, the longest period out of golf we've ever had, um, but the element of the game that tends to drop off the most is wedge play um, and the short game in general. So what I wanted to take you through uh, today was some areas and tips that I think will really help your performance on the wedge play and help you to get back into it once golf resumes. So let's have a look. Um, now, we're on the 18th at Torrey Pines, quite an iconic hole. Very tough little pitch shot that we've been left with here. Obviously, as you can see, over water, it's about a 50 yard shot, so one that we all, um, I can, I'm sure I can relate to in terms of toughness. Uh, I always find this shot quite difficult. Now, key thing here, obviously first port of course to get it over the water, but from a mental standpoint, I don't want you to even imagine it's there. So you want to be focusing on the point, an area on the green where you want the ball to land. So first thing that I would do, uh, obviously I'm sure most of you do this already, but to stand back, have a look, and try and get a perspective of the hole. And then what I would suggest you do is pick a spot in between the target and the golf ball that's in a direct line between your golf ball and say the flag or where you want that ball to end up. Once we've done that, into the golf ball. Now I always grip halfway down just to give me a little bit more control and understanding of where the club head is. Now I would always come in with a slightly open body position to help to get that club face aiming towards our little spot that we've chosen out in front of us. So once I've done that, I set my body position and get my shoulders aiming towards the target. I always like to open my feet a little bit, i.e. aim my feet slightly to the right. That helps and encourage a rotation and a good rotation through the ball to finish the shot off. Because a lot of us, when we hit this one, the bad one comes from when we decelerate. And I'll come on to that in a second. In your practice wins, try and gauge how far you want to take the club back, given the shot that you have. And replicate that two or three times to get a feeling and sensation of where you want that club to end up in the backswing. So we're gauging the length of our swing there. Okay. Once we have had those practice swings, again, set that golf club up so it's aiming towards where we want to go. Halfway down with the grip. Feet just under shoulder width apart. And like I said, I like to open my feet a little bit to encourage my rotation through the golf ball. And then focus on, in, during the golf swing, there's only one thing that I really focus on, and that's making sure that I finish so my chest is aiming at the target. So we've got a nice full follow through. We don't want to be quitting on that shot. If you take the club back and it's too far or too short, or the feeling is it's too far or too short, we want to still make sure that we drive right the way through. The last thing you want to do is decelerate. That's critical. And through those practice swings that you've just done, that should help you to encourage that. And that's what you want to replicate. So in over the golf ball, get yourself set. Back, drive through. Okay. Hope a few of those little elements help you with your short game and uh, the pitching obviously in particular. What I'd really like is for you to come back and give me some comments and send me some emails to say, right, okay, there's a particular area I wanna um, work on and get better at with regard to the wedge play. Um, send me an email or like say, comment on this video to say, yes, I would like to and would like to work on that area and I would like you to 
go through something that will help encourage a better shot and a more consistent shot um, for my game. Um, so yes, throw those comments in and what I'll try and do is uh, put those into the video so uh, they can help you in the future. Okay, hope to see you soon. Won't be long now, a couple of weeks time and we'll be back out on that golf course. Take care all.